Drones struck Ukraine's capital early Monday, leaving residents scrambling for safety. Rescue workers are now combing through pieces of rubble to try to find anyone trapped underneath. Trey Yings has more. Explosions rocking Ukraine's capital on Monday, sending black smoke and flames into the air. Ukrainian officials say Iranian-made suicide drones struck Kyiv early in the morning, damaging several apartment blocks and setting other buildings on fire. Air raid sirens sent residents fleeing to shelters as troops tried to shoot down the drones. Ukraine's military says dozens of them were destroyed. Uh, they have flown in from the south. Around 85 percent are destroyed by the air defense and other defense forces, including ground forces. After the strikes, rescue workers were out digging through the rubble, trying to find anyone still trapped. Kyiv's mayor says more than a dozen people were rescued from an apartment building. Strikes on the capital were rare in the last few months, but in recent weeks, Russian forces have ramped up their attacks, targeting critical infrastructure and urban centers throughout the city. Putin, you know, he's losing a ground war, obviously, uh, in Ukraine. In the meantime, what he's doing is attempting to conduct war on the Ukrainian people, to try to break their will and resolve. As the fighting continues, additional help is coming in from around the world. On Monday, the European Union plans to greenlight a military training mission for thousands of Ukrainian troops. It's very important that we establish a, a EU a military training mission to Ukraine and also that we uh, release more money uh, for um, supplying Ukraine with uh, weapons. Iranian officials deny they've supplied any drones to Russia. In Kyiv, Trey Inkst, Fox News.